how God uses youth to inspire. All this and more next on CTAB News. Good morning, Christian Tabernacle. I'm Melva Allen with your CTAB News for Sunday, March 27, 2011. This week closes out March Madness. Let's give God praise for all of our youth and their guests who came out to have fun for Christ. The youth had a great time competing and sharing in fellowship, so parents continue to encourage your youth to come out on Tuesday evenings. The Bible says, pray without ceasing. Pastor Mormon is looking for all to gather in the sanctuary every Sunday morning at 9.30 for corporate prayer. Find this week's daily Bible readings at ctapchurch.org and continue to meditate daily on the Word of God to live a victorious and joyful life. Minutes that time again for Brotherhood, Monday, April 4th in the Family Life Center. Mark your calendars and come out for fellowship. Ladies of CTAP, save the date for Girls Night Out at the Suburban Collection Showplace on April 15th. What an event we have planned just for you. Tickets are available in the bookstore for $25. Be sure to stop by to get your tickets. Another important date to save is May 21st. The Health Cabinet Ministry is sponsoring the Susan G. Coleman Breast Cancer Walk at Comerica Park. Registration will begin next week in the Fellowship Hall. Now, here's Cherise Richardson with our youth segment. Thanks, Melba. The Bible says without faith, it is impossible to please God. Having faith is important for our spiritual health. Here's one believer's testimony. My prayer was to make the varsity basketball team in my school. God had already blessed me to improve my grades, so I knew it could be done. The goal was important for me because I knew that I was a good player and could make varsity as a sophomore. But I knew it would be difficult because a lot of people were trying out. Pastor always says, if you have faith the size of a mustard seed, then you can make it. So I kept praying and kept believing that God would show up. Matthew 17, 20. So Jesus said to them, because of your unbelief, for surely I say to you, if you have faith as a mustard seed, you will say to this mountain, move from here to there and it will move and nothing will be impossible for you. I just kept believing that it was going to happen, that I was going to make it. Then during the team meeting, the coach told me that I had made the varsity team. The Lord had answered my prayer. When he told me I had made the team, I immediately started thanking God. Just keep trusting and believing in what you want God to do for you. And in time, he will show up when you need him the most. So remember to exercise your faith daily, whether if it's school, sports, anything. It is needed for your spiritual health. I'm Sharice Richardson for CTAB News. Thanks, Sharice. What a great story. If you have a news idea or testimony you'd like to share, please send an email to news at ctapchurch.org. At this time, we'd like to extend a friendly welcome to all of our visitors. If this is your first time sharing in our CTAB experience, we thank you for coming and encourage you to visit again. Stop by the Welcome Center after service so we can bless you with a special gift. That's all for this edition of CTAB News. I'm Melva Allen, and remember this acronym, TGIF. Today, God is first. Have a blessed week.